वॉट इज अप गाइज कैसे हो आप लोग वी आर बैक विद अनदर वीडियो ऑन द ट्वेंटी थ्री राइट चैनल अबाउट द न्यू रॉयल एनफील्ड हिमालयन एंड दिस इज द कैमेट वाइट कलर एंड दिस टाइम द वर्जन डेट वी हैव गॉट फ्रॉम रॉयल एनफील्ड इज द वर्जन विच हैज द ट्यूबलेस स्पोक व्हील्स और एज दे कॉल इट द क्रॉस स्पोक व्हील्स एंड लॉन्ग विद दिस दिस वर्जन इज ऑल्सो फिटेड विद सम जेनुअन एक्सेसरीज फ्रॉम रॉयल एंड फील्ड दैट दे हैव कम अप विद स्पेसिफिकली फॉर द हिमालयन नाउ वी नो दैट द डिलीवरीज ऑफ द हिमालयन हैव ऑलरेडी स्टार्टेड द कलर्स दैट आर बींग सोल्ड द मोस्ट आर द काजा ब्राउन ऑब्वियसली विच इज द चीपेस्ट ऑप्शन एंड द हानली ब्लैक वाइल देर वॉज इनिशियली अ कन्फ्यूजन अबाउट द कलर्स द न्यू कन्फ्यूजन दैट इज देयर इन द माइंड ऑफ अ लॉट ऑफ प्रोस्पेक्टिव बायर्स डेट हैव सीन सो फार इज दैट शुड वी बाय द traditional spoke wheel version that is there on offer right now or should we wait for the tubeless spoke wheel or the cross spoke wheel as they call it which provides you an insurance around the punctures that you might get on the long tours or should we wait for the rally spec version in this video i'll be talking about certain factors that will help you decide on which version you should go with amongst the three that i just mentioned the simple spokes the cross spokes and the rally version under normal circumstances if royal enfield would have launched the cross spoke version right now it would have been a no brainer everyone should have actually gone for the cross spoke wheel version because there are no advantages that the traditional spoke wheels would offer over the cross spoke wheels logically speaking there is no competition or no comparison at all but since the timing that has been decided by royal enfield is a little weird to launch the cross spoke wheel version in india there is that confusion whether to buy it now or whether to wait for that version but all this being said there is another question what will be the price of the cross spoke wheel version because right now there is no official figure from royal enfield but from what i know and what i've heard the pricing should not be actually more than 50000 rupees i think 50000 will also be too much it should be around 35 to 40000 rupees let's see when it comes if you want to spend or if you have that sort of a budget right now that you are able to spend 50000 rupees additional on the royal enfield himalayan then my plain and simple recommendation would be to wait for the cross spoke wheel version this is very logical and and i will definitely not be the first person who is telling you this but if you are totally excited about the himalayan you just want to get it home now the first thing that i am pretty sure you guys will have in mind is buy the himalayan now whenever the cross spoke wheel version comes then we'll sell our uh, the standard set of wheels that we get on this base himalayan model and upgrade to the cross spoke wheel version but if you don't want to do that if you don't want to spend that additional amount for the cross spoke wheel versions what are the options do you have actually there are two options number 1 is a solution that i have tried myself because i used to have a tiger 800 xca which used to come with simple spokes it's an adventure touring motorcycle an expensive heavy adventure touring motorcycle with a 21 inch front wheel and the genes of an adventure tourer are kind of shared between these two motorcycles what i tried in that was using a solution called as the outex and this outex solution is something which can actually transform your simple spoke wheels to the tubeless spoke wheel version because it helps you seal the traditional rims which actually allow for air to leak through if you use tubeless tires on those simple rims how an outex solution would actually work is very simple uh here in this sort of a version while you have those cross spoke wheels the traditional ones will have the spokes in the center somewhere here and what will happen is using the tapes that are provided in the outex kit which costs around 17000 rupees for me that outex sort of a solution of sealing the rims with the tapes the multiple tapes worked perfectly for 3 years and i was super happy with it because i towed on my tiger 800 for around 26 27000 kilometers and i never experienced any sort of air leakage from any of the wheels so that is one solution that you can definitely go for if 17000 rupees is something that you feel is too much for you to spend then there is a cheaper option as well which i have seen people using which is called as the way to speed solution Uh, which is technically a solution itself it's kind of a gel that is put on the 
inside of the rims which helps seal all those holes and the idea remains the same that you can avoid that you can prevent all the air from leaking from those spokes and then you can end up using those tubeless tires on the motorcycle which is a big convenience so 17000 rupees for the outtex solution and around 7 8000 rupees for the way to speed solution which is also being used by a lot of motorcycle riders right now specifically those who are riding an interceptor or a himalayan the previous himalayan and all now all these solutions by the way are for those people who cannot wait for the cross spoke wheel version to arrive which will arrive maybe sometime around march or april that's what i have heard but no guarantees and certainties around it Now let us talk about the third category of people who are actually waiting for the rally version. When will the rally version come? Do we have any timelines? I don't think so we have any sort of timelines from Royal Enfield. I think it might come in the fag end of 2024 sometime around September October. Don't think it will come any time before that. So that is definitely going to be a long wait for you guys. But one thing that I want you to really think about is If you are waiting for this rally version be sure that you are the type of person who actually needs it now rallying and that hard core off roading stuff is done by just 1 or 2% of the people who actually buy bikes like the Himalayan which weigh 196 kg for a proper rally bike this might be a little too heavy and typically a rally bike would be in that 175 or 180 kg maximum kind of a weight range then there is one thing that will come or launch before that rally version i am pretty sure is the expulse 400 now considering the capabilities expulse 200 has shown over the last few years i would really put my money on the expulse 400 to be that rally bike that most of this audience is actually wanting from the himalayan if they are waiting for that rally version so guys really think about it because sometime around may or june is when we are expecting the expulse 400 to launch and with the jeans and the structure and the frame that motorcycle has and what it has done with the 200 avatar then i think the 400 avatar is definitely going to be something that you should wait for so to conclude i would like to suggest you guys that if you are in a hurry and getting the spoke wheel version of the himalayan and do not want to wait for the cross spoke wheel version to come then be prepared to spend at least 15 to 20000 for getting that robust outtex solution installed on your himalayan rims because that is something that is going to give you a lot of peace of mind when you are touring on this beautiful machine which is super capable of munching miles all day long if you can wait then getting the cross spoke wheel version is going to be the most logical decision because when you get those wheels and if you intend to switch those with the ones that you have on your recently purchased himalayan which are the traditional spoke wheels then those traditional spoke wheels are going to be rendered useless and the price that you will be getting in the after sale second hand sort of a market for those traditional spoke wheels is not going to be something great because that is not going to be something that is going to be very beneficial from a financial transaction standpoint so that is my take on it so let me know if you have any other questions about the new himalayan I will be sharing more details about this fully spec'd out version in my coming videos and I look forward to staying connected. Bye bye, take care and ride safe.